Hello everyone. I am Vatsal. Welcome you all to my channel. And today I am going to show you how to fix the error USB device not recognized in Windows 11. So if you are trying to insert some USB device or pen drive into your system, and if you are getting this error message, USB device not recognized, then there are four methods to fix this issue. In method number one, there are three steps. So the step number one is just go to the search bar and type control panel. Yeah, just click on the search result control panel and now just make the view by as large icons. Now click on power options. Now for the balanced, just click on change plan settings. Now just click on change advanced power setting. Now in this window, just go down and just expand USB settings. Then expand USB selective suspend setting. And now for these two options, on battery and plugged in, just change their value to disabled. So just click on it and change its value to disabled. After changing their value to disabled, just click on the apply button and click on the ok button. Close this window. So this was step number one. Now step number two is Go to the start button, right click over it and click on the option device manager. Now just expand this universal serial bus controllers. And now you have to update all the drivers under this universal serial bus controller. So now I show you how to do it. So just select the driver, right click over it and click on the option update driver click on the first option search automatically for drivers so it will search the internet for the updates and if it find any update then it will show it here and you just click on the install button to install it but if it shows this message the best driver for your device are already installed then just click on the close button now do the same thing for the other two drivers also just update them like I did for the first one. So this was step number two. Now the step number three is just click on USB root hub. Right click over it and click on properties option. Now go to the power management tab and now just uncheck this option allow the computer to turn off this device to save power. Just uncheck it and click on the OK button. Now close this window and now just restart your system and after restarting your system just plug in the USB device and just check whether your issue is resolved or not. So this was method number one. Now let's move to the method number two. Go to the search bar and now in the search bar just type CMD. Now just right click over the search result command prompt. Click on the option run as administrator. Click on yes. And now you have to execute one command. I will give this command in the video description. You can copy it from there. So the command is msdt.exe space hyphen id space device diagnostic. After this, just hit enter. So it will open a hardware and device troubleshooting window. Just click on the next button. So it will automatically find the USB related problems and fix them also. So just follow the instructions shown in this window. Now click on this option first one. So you can now just click on this apply this fix option and fix your issue. I will click on this cancel button as I am doing the video recording. Now just type exit and hit enter. So this was method number two. Now let's move to the method number three. Go to the start button again, right click over it and click on the option device manager. Now again expand universal serial bus controllers. 
and just click on Intel USB extensible host controller. The name may be different in your system, but it will have this host controller written in its name. So just select it, Intel USB extensible host controller, right click over it and click on the option uninstall device. Click on the uninstall button. Just click on uninstall button. If it shows any checkbox here, do not check it. Just click on the uninstall button. So it is now uninstalled. Now wait for few seconds. And after this, just go to the top menu and click on action menu. Under action menu, just click on scan for hardware changes option. And it will reinstall it. So you can see that it is now installed again, the USB drivers. Now just try plugging in the USB device and just check whether your issue is resolved or not. So this was method number 3. Now the method number 4 is just try plugging in the USB device into some other port. So just unplug it from the current port and just plug it in some other port and just check whether your issue is resolved or not. So these were the four methods that you can try out to fix USB device not recognized in Windows 11. So that's it from my side. If you like my video, you can click on the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.